Hi there. I made this uh, video because a user in the DVD Styler forum has some problem uh, using a WAP file. I've started DVD Styler and in this project I'm going to use NTSC. Okay, that. I don't want any template. What I have here is a file that I have uh, taken from DVD Styler's cache. It's a video object file and uh, I'll drag mm -hmm. that onto DVD Styler like that. Uh, the default button is an animated uh, video button so I'll set a duration on that for say 30 seconds. Okay to that. And okay, th okay that. Now the user's problem, I'll take that away, is that uh, he can't jump to a chapter within that video. So I'll create a button here and have that start the video at chapter 5. Uh, my chapters, they are the default at 10 minutes interval. So. I'll create an ISO image. Uh, I'll do one thing more before that. I don't want to remultiplex or transcode, so I do that. Uh, and I'll create an ISO image. Call that ISO one. Start that. And here I cut out some of the video. And it uh, generated successfully, so let's test it. I have here my ISO image, which I'll drag onto VLC player. Start the video from the start. Go back to my menu, on, try punk. to see this. My feet hurt. And it uh, jumped right into chapter 5. Ow. It will be here around 40 Ow. minutes. So Not it tense. works okay. Not tense. Angry girl. Now, from the luck of the user, I don't think this was ticked actually. So I'll create another one without the TIG on it, call that ISO 2, and start. And again I'll cut something out of the video. generated successfully so I'll try to test it I have my ISO image here which I drag onto VLC I start the video from its start works ok go back to the menu and start at chapter 5 again and it works as it should I'm using uh, DVD Styler version 2.6 point uh, beta 2, okay. 